greenish lifting plant plant view. We have all the blocks already we created. Using that block, we need to create lifting crane lifting plant view. For that, go to the this dynamic block. This is plan view dynamic blocks we made for crane. Select this one, control C and go to the project folder and control V. Now we are going to place this reactor in this portion. First we need to select which is your exact portion. Okay, so I am going to make it in between this portion. So for that go to line, shift right click, mid between two point, just click here and I click here and I just made a line like this. Our crane radius is 16 meter. I am going to make 16 meter crane radius. So we need to place our crane somewhere else here. I just take this crane block, click this point and I place it here. So here this crane didn't clash any other things. It is freely we can keep. Select this one, just click here, make it out trigger 7500. So this is comfortably placed. Now this is the radius 16 meter. I just go to the circle and make a circle 16 meter enter. This is the crane travel distance and I just place it here like this. Now we need to unload from trailer and we need to place it our reactor here. So select this is the reactor and this is a reactor CG I consider here. So select this one and I just place it here. Okay, this is the install location but we need to take from crane that also we need to show so we need to go this is the crane plan view so select this screen and move command go to the move command just select this one enter and just place it like this but we cannot stop like this okay we can we have some road access something like this so you can make a friend this side and back the trailer side we can keep here. So first just select this crane not crane trailer and go to the rotate just click here make it minus 90 degree so it is rotated like this. But where is the location of this one? So just select this one and copy and I just click this exactly I click this point okay and I just place somewhere else here okay which is the suitable location when you load this one that time you will place somewhere else so I consider this is the place so select this both and go to the move command and I click this Exactly, this is I consider this is the CG point, so I consider here and I place it somewhere else here. But we need to we cannot keep like this exactly. I just make from this point to some distance. So that is good practice. So this is our least this is a exactly you cannot clash this one without clashing we need to keep this one so I just go to the offset make it 10 meter and offset so once I offset 10 meter so I can place it the trailer approximately here so I select this trailer and go to the move command just click this point I consider as a CG so I just place it exactly somewhere else okay it's ready 
Now we need to place this crane also. Just click this crane point and you can place it here. Now everything is ready. This is the crane, uh, the boom traveling radius. This is crane. Now we don't want this line. I just delete it. Now the plan view is ready. We don't want this line also. And this, if you need to make different line styles, you can make your own line styles and you can make it. But I just make it center line. Okay. So now if it is not showing, just increase that one. And like that, if you increase the line type scale you will get it clear visibility so now the plan view is ready we need to pick up from this point and we need to install this point so this is the way we need to create crane lifting plan view in AutoCAD first we need to locate our crane properly without clashing anything when you locate that one also that time also don't clash then when you install when you work this screen that time also you need to consider without clashing without affecting any site equipment or structure you are bringing here you need to travel this side if you have any post or uh, electrical line or pipeline or any other equipment is there or not you need to check before so visibility study is very important in crane lifting